everyone, and welcome to my Grandma Gamers channel. I'm Mia, and this is my B&E series of breaking and entering into people's Final Fantasy XIV homes. So join me and be my accomplice, and let's go and scope out some of the neighborhoods in Final Fantasy XIV. Let's get ready and go. Gabby, hurry up and get inside those packages. You can hide there. Those packages and boxes are big enough for you. They're big enough for me. They're big enough for you. We're supposed to be at Little Rain's house doing the house sitting thing. We're not supposed to be over here yet, even though we told everybody we was bringing all the liquor and all that stuff here. We're not supposed to be here yet. But eventually, we got to come over here and check out the Chocobo, which, you know what? I think that the winning chocobo, that racing chocobo, is that one right there. See how they have all that? I don't know if you can see it real well, but it's got like, here, let me, there was some people standing out front. Maybe they're gone. I don't know. But see that chocobo right there? Look at these. Look at them. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, wow, these are winning chocobo racers. That is just absolutely beautiful. We may have to take those with us and sell them, or we'll escape on them or something. But those are winning chocobo racers. Okay, and look at, they got stuff all out here for Christmas, so we gotta take all these packages to the um, kids, up in the mountain kids, because they need packages and there's snow. And I am so not ready for snow, nor am I ready for that brick wall. So, but look, they've got a yellow bridge, and they've got another snowman here, and they've got those pumpkin lights, and more snowmen, and they're growing things. Oh, I wonder if this is what they feed the chocobos. <gasps> you know what? Maybe we can give some of these to Valley because he's trying to make his chocobo go faster. So that would be, that might help his chocobo. And look at, this is just so pretty and so nice. And okay, I'll tell you where we are. We are at Castle Nako. And the owner, the FC name is um, Struggle Snuggle, and their tag is Oh Nose. And they are on the Diablo server, medium house in the mist, ward 12, um, plot 34, and their greeting is Go ahead, call the Yellow Jackets, they can't unsnuggle you. <laughs> That's cute. And their slogan is the same thing Go ahead, call the Yellow Jackets, they can't unsnuggle you. Um, they're open recruiting, they are looking for everybody, the only thing, they do everything but role playing, so if you're looking for a struggle snuggle type FC house, I would say this is the place to um, come and join their FC. So come on and let's go check out Struggle Snuggle's house. Oh, these people are like, wow, they have a white rug right as you come in the entrance. So as soon as you come in, you're supposed to wipe your feet on the white rug before you take your shoes off? Hmm. But look, they also have lots of presents in here. They are so ready for Christmas and the holidays and all those other holidays, the happy holiday season. Okay, so let's check out their house. Gabi, be ready. Oh, the Hengon set is in red and green, and I like what they did to this table. They put a partition planter, a planter partition in the middle of it. Or is that two of them? Nope, that's just one. And then they put some um, candlesticks on it. That's kind of cool. I like that. And they've got some plants and more Christmas decorations. And, oh wow, what's this? I'm going to read the note. It says, oh wow, it's just pure strategy on racing chocobos. Maybe they all race their chocobos. Oh wow, I mean the two out front were 
gorgeous. So yeah, this is just Chocobo strategy. Hmm, look at all these books too. That must be what these books are all about. Chocobo strategies on how to win. Oh wow. Okay, and they have one of the little um, orchestrons. They're so cute. And pillars for more. And they've got this little greeting area back here in the back. <gasps> Gabby, there's a toy box. I know. You can sit back here and hang out with these guys and play in the toy box, but we're taking the toy box, so you won't be able to play in that anymore. There's artwork up there with a bamboo tree and some a planter above the free company door. This is pretty nice. I like this. Okay, let's go check out the upstairs. And we've got more Christmas, or well, holiday decorations. I guess it's not politically correct it's supposed to be holiday decorations and you know I agree with all religions with all of their celebrations so holiday Christmas and I forget what the events name is called here for the holiday season so I don't mean to offend anybody so, okay and there's a coffin in the middle of the table <gasps> I wonder if they put the loser of the chocobo races in here. <gasps> Wouldn't that be, oh my gosh, that would just be so, that would be rough. I wouldn't want to be in here. Okay, and they've got all their trophies up here, and that's pretty cool. I like how they've got this room set up. They've got a Christmas tree over here, and or a holiday tree with more presents. But we're taking the presents, so they're just gonna have to go get more. And they've got the same t table set up here as they do downstairs, and they have the the jaws of life <laughs> in the aquarium. <laughs> okay, now let's see. So this is just really nice. I like that it all matches. I really like all this. This is nice. Okay, now let's go downstairs and see what they've got downstairs. They've got an elephant. I love the elephant. And they've got a music room. Um, I like how they've got like the different colors of the instruments. That's, that's really nice. I like that. The white, the yellow, the dark reds, and the black. Or maybe that's blue. It, it looks blue, but it also looks black. I think it's blue. That's pretty nice. So they can sit out here and drink some cocktails and sing along and sing all the carols. That should be a good time. Fun times. Oh, Gobby, do you see all the stuffies and plushies up there? Oh, yeah, we got to get all of those and take those because there's so many of them. They don't need that many. Oh, yeah, those are nice up there. Let's see, what else do they got? Ah, they've got one crafting table. So, you have to be a goldsmither. That's it. They don't need any other... Well, maybe they. everybody has all the other crafts done, but um, crafting skills done, but goldsmithing. So, there's that. And they've got... A hot tub area back here with a shower and they have the kimonos so I guess after you get out of the hot tub you just come over here and instead of drying off on towels you just grab a new kimono so uh-oh sorry so that's really nice okay this house is really super nice struggle snuggle you did a great job at your house i like it everything goes well the colors go well you're all ready for all the holidays which is really super great so please check out my other housing videos the gill savings and other ones as well you if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and show the owner of this house how much you liked it and please subscribe you know i need all those subscriptions if you push the little bell looking thing you can receive an email letting you know that um when i post a new video 
This is Grandma Mia for Grandma Gamers Channel. Take care, have fun, and be safe out there.